Glad you could join our fight. I'm General Farvin. Darth Gravis tells me you're the best merc on Tyrus. Maybe you can teach these blasted Mandalorians how to fight. We brought them here to help slay the Cathar, wipe the Republic off Tyrus. But the Mandalorians are sloppy. No respect for a clean victory. To rout the Cathar, we need good old-fashioned Imperial might, and you, of course. Bring me up to speed. We've hit a wall. Our mission was to scorch this entire district. Now the Republic's allies are fighting back. Cathar settlements cover this part of Tarras. They're defending their homes under the leadership of a feral warrior. His name's Bashoon. Some call him ferocious, brutal, terrifying. I say he's a dirty alien who needs to be put down. I have experience taking out Republic pawns. Commander Order, Master Sulan, I heard. But this Cathar's a wily one. Bashoon escaped our assassination attempts. Now he's deeply entrenched with state-of-the-art weaponry. Gifts from the Republic. I've got a gift of my own. Killed another ten of the Cathar's best. Few more and I can make a coat. Enjoy nipping at my heels, Merc. Stop following me or you'll lose an arm. You wouldn't stand a chance against me. Your overconfidence will be your downfall. Stop. Take your anger out on Bashum. But first, we must pull down his defenses. Republic munitions are stockpiled at his camps, defended by the Cathar's best warriors. Republic combat droids, too. Without those weapons, the Cathar and Bashun are vulnerable. We need to take them out now. Bashun will soon be weaponless. This mission is too important to let you mess it up. I'm going as well. Let us see who can exterminate more of Bashun's best warriors. I'll bet my pay that you lose. You're going to take that from her? Beat Thana at her own game. Crush the Cathar's weapons. I took out the Cathar's weaponry. They're defenseless. Don't try taking all the credit. I smashed more than my share of munitions. Excellent work, both of you. Though I'm sorry you didn't kill enough Cathar to win Thana's little game. Not even close. My attention was focused on the Cathar's weapons. Likely excuse. Drop the attitude. We have to hit Bashun now, before the Republic rearms the Cathar. Just tell me where their leader's hiding. Bashun's protected by heavy security. Installed after our failed assassination attempt. Lost my top commanders that day. Now he's entrenched in a Republic base, building his defense. Only the Empire's best can take him down. I'm the best there is. Leave Bashun's death to me. I'll take on the Cathar's leader myself. Not a chance. I'll slay this Cathar before you step inside his base. She's beyond my control. See that Bashun's killed and don't let Thana compromise the mission. The Empire's trying to drive us from Terrace. From our homes. Soon they'll learn that Cathar never backed down. Keep talking, Bashun. When I get out of here, I'll stomp out your entire species. The Empire sent this Sith to kill me. But she failed. Proof that none can defeat the mighty Cathar. Don't even bother resisting. The Empire just doesn't know when to quit. You know, Cathar aren't the only settlers on Terrace. The Nikto have joined us along with their Morgukai warriors. We're all refugees fleeing the Empire's cruelty. And I promise you, my Cathar, we won't be uprooted again. Any home you make here will be wiped out by the Empire. The Republic will shield us. As long as they hold Terrace, we'll fight to defend it. Watch closely, fellow Cathar. Witness our enemy's downfall. It's not over. Keep fighting. Use your last breath to save your followers. Make them leave Terrace, or we'll kill them all. I suppose there must be another planet they can call home. Fellow settlers, the Empire's won. Lay down your weapons. Leave Terrace while you still can. I'm sorry I failed you.
They'd better run fast. I'll kill every straggler I find. But first, I could use a hand over here. Let me out. Please. Stay in there a while. Think about that attitude of yours. I'm going to escape. And when I do, you'd better be long gone. I intercepted Bashun's final transmission. Magnificent work. I've never seen such a strong warrior broken so fast. The Cathar listen to him. They're fleeing Taras. The less Republic minions on this planet, the better. And now, with the Cathar weakened, the ways open for our final offensive. There you are! Three meters of Durasteel. That's what I cut through to escape my cell. I hope the time alone taught you patience and charm. Oh, I'm all reformed. Going to celebrate by cutting you in half. What was that, Thana? Your transmission, it's, it's breaking up. Much better. I've heard enough of her ranting. Lord Gravis expects you to lead our final attack. Regretfully, I can't join you. My duties here are wiping out any resisting Cathar. Head to the Republic outskirts. Meet Lord Shathan. When flames and evac shuttles choke the skies, I'll know you've crushed the Republic base. Lord Shathan at your service. I was relieved to hear you'll be leading our assault. Consider it a testament to your skill. Mercenaries don't usually spearhead Imperial attacks. Darth Gravis, your friend has arrived. You've performed well. Taris is scarred. The Republic support weakened. I trust you're ready to deliver the killing blow. How do you plan on breaking the Republic? We will crush the Republic reconstruction and the Jedi responsible. Thanks to you, they're cornered in their base. Their final sanctuary on Taris. And soon to be their tomb. Don't worry, Gravis. I'll tear down their base, then soak Terris with Republic blood. Who invited you, Thana? Terris is my hunting ground. I go where I want. Thana, I knew you'd come running at the first scent of blood. Unfortunately, the base's approach is infested with Republic forces. They're blocking our army's advance. Rain bombs on their heads. They're shielded. Only close combat will work. Shields or not, I want them pulverized. Without their defenses, Thana can catch the Republic forces off guard. Break the machines if you want. I'm more of a blood and bruises woman. Clear the battlefield, then we'll hit the Republic base and finally drive them off Talis. Darth Gravis, it appears we're ready. I disabled the Republic's shields. It's all up to Thana now. I killed them all. Didn't even break a sweat. Fantastic work, both of you. We must act quickly before the Republic deploys reinforcements. Lord Shathan, begin the attack. At once, my lord. The final battle for Taris has begun. If we are to demolish this planet, you and Thana must join forces. I'm willing to put aside our differences, if she is. No, you've dragged me down long enough. The Republic's annihilation demands your complete cooperation, Thana. I'll help, Gravis, if only to prepare for the day I strike you down. Splendid. Your mission is twofold. Blow up the Republic spaceport, and eliminate the leader of their reconstruction efforts, a powerful Jedi Master named Serik. The Republic won't quickly recover from that one-two punch. Their wound must be painful enough to discourage their return. Once Master Serik falls, the Republic will be forced to abandon Taris. The spaceport's destruction will block their reinforcements, and trap the doomed survivors here. Darth Gravis, the attack's underway. Republic transports are in orbit, headed for their spaceport. They're trying to flee. 
If we don't kill Master Serek now, he'll return with a full occupation force. I've got a blaster with Serek's name on it. Make your shots count. That Jedi won't fall easily. Infiltrate the Republic base. Disable the Space World safety measures. Then meet Thana in the lower levels. Only together can you destroy the Republic's dreams. And don't keep me waiting. If you get the chance, take out the Republic's assault cannons. They're making life painful for our boys. Control. We need to kill Sarek and blow this place, now. Way ahead of you. Since you finally disabled the Republic's safety measures, I can force their power grid to go critical and... What? Ugh. The spaceport's set to blow, but those blasted Jedi installed a failsafe. Let's find Sarek and rip the override code from his dead hands. Calm the evacuees. The transports will be ready any moment now. The Republic will not lose Terrace. Terrace's reconstruction dies here, with you. Finally, the intruders show themselves. I'm going to enjoy killing you, Serik. Darth Gravis is amazingly predictable. This is a trap, and you walked right into it. The evacuation transports that arrived weren't empty. They brought friends, ready to defend Terrace. Perhaps you're familiar with them? You'd need an entire fleet of reinforcements to take me down. I think we'll do just fine. This is it! Defend Terrace with your lives! Too bad there aren't more of them. I was just getting warmed up. And what do we have here? Serik's failsafe code. Just punch this in and there. The power is over there. So long, Republic. I have to admit, you are actually useful. I always deliver. You'd know that if... Wait a second. Those transports that brought Serex back up, they're loaded with civilians. They're actually trying to open the hangar. They'll escape the explosion. Open the hangar. They've already lost enough. You really know how to sap the joy out of a good massacre. is open. And there they go. What a waste. Anyway, this place is about to explode. Much as I'd like to see you disintegrated, I suggest you run. Or stay. See if I care. You've outlived your usefulness, Thana. Eric's gone, and the spaceport is in flames. Excellent. Those assault cannons hit my men hard, but they're pushing back to take the base. Darth Gravis will want to hear the details. That I do. But first, I want to personally thank our champion. With Master Serik's death, this planet's reconstruction will crumble. The civilians who escaped will spread news of his defeat. Soon, Taris will be completely ruined. A tribute to the power of the Sith, the Empire, and you. Happy to be of service. Your loyalty will be recognized. But there's still the matter of Thana. She hasn't returned. 
and I no longer feel her presence on Taris. She served her purpose, so I disposed of her. I suspected as much. Under normal circumstances, I'd strike you down. But considering the wounds you inflicted on the Republic, I'll ignore my grievance. Thanks to your actions, Taris will stand as a shining testament to the Empire's supremacy. And you will go down in history as the lone mercenary capable of tearing down an entire planet.